So we're going to take a look at the Beat 707 using in a conjunction with Sonar and I'm using external sound modules too and a MIDI box for four MIDI inputs and four MIDI outputs and everything controlled by my Amy Audio keyboard and the hack I have added here I'm just going to quickly show a bit just overview on the next video I'm going to go in deep each of the features of this new hack but uh, in essence I have added each pattern to each of these keys here I have set syn synchronization of the MIDI clock of beat 707 to slave and my sonar to send the MIDI sync timing clock so it's now sending the clock, you can see the, the LEDs blinking there sending the clock to the beat 707 and as, as soon as I hit a, a, a note here, it's going to start the pattern and it's only going to stop if my sequencer on the sonar stops or if I hit the lower key. And uh, if I press a, a key here, it's going to load the pattern of the key I'm pressing and it starts playing right away. So on my sonar project, I have added the patterns with the corresponding key on the top and routed the MIDI signal to my external sound device. So when I hit play on sonar, it's going to hit play on the on Beat 772 and the right pattern. And if I hit stop, it's going to stop right away. So it's pretty simple. On the next video, I'll show a bit more.